Okay, Bob423 here. Uh, this is part two of the discussion about buoys. And we're going to talk about the um, Coast Guard data buoys because they come with a lot of information that may not be apparent at first glance. For example, at red number 30 here, you see a strange symbol that has like four arrows on it. Let's tap it. And what the Coast Guard is saying in their uh, local notes to mariners is that it's off station. So you can't depend upon being where it's depicted to be on the chart. The same thing for number 31. That's off station. Uh, doesn't matter that much if you're following the blue line uh, because it'll take you through there safely anyway. But it's good to know that it's not where you would expect to see it. When you're looking out ahead of you, headed south, and think your charts are right, and in fact, uh, these two buoys may not be where they're supposed to be. Let's move further south. We'll go to uh, a famous area, Cumberland Divides. And now you see a different symbol. Let's see what that means. It says the structure is destroyed, has not been replaced yet uh, with a buoy or anything else that's uh, destroyed and not there. Maybe it's underneath the uh, water a little bit. So you want to give out a wide berth when you see that. And these alerts, by the way, are right out of the uh, Coast Guard uh, local notice to mariners, updated weekly. Let's move further down the coast. Okay, and now we're coming in to the approach uh, to Fernandina. And there we go. And now, once again, you see the red and green's reverse sides. Number 44 red is now to be passed to port. But if you were to look at it carefully, you would see a yellow square on that uh, buoy, which indicates it should be treated as a green buoy as far as the ICW is concerned. And you see a new symbol, an X. Let's see what that means. Structure destroyed, but this time it's been replaced temporarily by a lighted buoy, which is nice to know. And it has a couple of strange symbols here. TR-SY, what does that mean? TR means the triangle is red, which indicates for the purpose that it is that buoy is in fact a red buoy. But more importantly, it has SY on it, which means it's a square yellow. It's to be treated as a green buoy as far as the ICW is concerned. So let's go further down the page quickly and we get into ICW, or get into Fernandina, and you see another of these four-way symbols. This time it tells you that it's been relocated for dredging. It's not where it is on the chart. Relocated for dredging, and they'll put it back when they get dredging done. So that's our uh, two-minute uh, tutorial on some of the symbols used uh, by the Coast Guard to indicate, uh, in Aquamap at least, uh, the, a, some of the status uh, of the buoys, and if you tap on them, you get more information, the same information that's in the Coast Guard local notice to mariners for that buoy. And that cl closes out part two.